Welcome Aries. I'm back y'all with another video. So this is going to be for the sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node, south node, all of that, all of that good stuff, okay? This is Aries energy, okay? Keep, please keep in mind, guys, that it is a general read, so it may or may not resonate with you. So if it happens to resonate, then good. If it does not, then check your moon and your rising signs, okay? What message is there for my Aries? If you are interested in booking a personal, all of that information is in the drop box below. All right. I also have uh, four or five. I think I have four little oils. Okay. This is the mermaid oil. This is my little flirty oil. Okay. <laughs> this oil can be purchased on the website. She is beautiful. We also have the truth oil. All right. It is infused with uh, clear quartz crystals if you're trying to get the truth about a situation this is going to be the one for you honey all that is going to be on my website the information is in the drop box below all right so let's talk let's talk let's talk let's talk aries all right What message is there for my Aries, please? All right, so we got the chariot here. So there is progression. There is forward movement. Ooh, ten of wands. So it looks like y'all are dropping the situation and charging ahead, okay? Mm. Yeah, y'all dropping something, man. And, <laughs> like, charging ahead. Like, it is... I'm out of here. <laughs> All right. Ten of Pentacles. Great energy to start out with. Uh, but then we got the Nine of Swords. Okay, so what's going on? Woo! Six of Pentacles. Five of Cups. Nine of Pentacles. The Magician. Two of Wands, Queen of Pentacles, the Devil, and the Queen of Swords. Y'all being the Ice King, the Ice Queen. <laughs> Somebody here is getting sales or getting, um, I'm just getting like, you guys have planned something. Or you're ready for uh, abundance. You've done the work for abundance to come in. But I do want to see why we have you being anxious. Or what? Let's see why the Nine of Swords is here. The Ace of Pentacles. So definitely finances and security and abundance is the topic of discussion for February. Okay. Yes, you're realizing that you have the potential to do something. You're realizing that this is this you have the potential. You can do this. Okay? Wow, like y'all. Okay, why is the five of cups here? Why is the five of cups here? The hierophant. Okay, maybe you regret being so uh modest. Because we got the Empress here as well, too. I'm getting a lot of growth. Um, I'm getting, you could be dealing with a Taurus. Why is the heart for here? The tower. Yeah, there was some type of tower moment here. Because y'all coming through. <laughs> like, maybe y'all been too nice. Maybe y'all was going by the rules for a little while. And then y'all was like, you know what? <laughs> this i'm about to bust out okay because i'm tired of being i'm tired of being nice i'm tired of being friendly that ain't cutting it for me that ain't gonna cut it for me i'm a grown-ass woman i'm a grown-ass man and i'm getting that there's a lot of growth here 
I'm getting like there's a lot of growth here. Why is the tower in here? Some of y'all could be dealing with the Scorpio. Oh, wow. Okay, so something abruptly ended. Could be a marriage. Just could be a way of thinking, a perspective. Somebody walked away. So it's like this tower moment happened. Everything came crumbling down and you're rebuilding. Okay, we got a new start. So you're rebuilding. Maybe somebody... Uh, got caught cheating maybe uh someone was playing with somebody's emotions or you felt like emotionally manipulated or something in a sense like that but i'm getting like you are now open your eyes is open your eye is open i feel like um with the five of wands you may uh realize that there's some competition here or you feel like you there's a need to like step your game up Oh, oh, I'm getting the Ten of Swords and the Knight of Cups. Now, this deck has two Ten of Swords cards. So, do you have the Ten of Swords and Knight of Cups? Like, you feel like you don't got to explain nothing to nobody. Five of Swords, like, y'all ain't playing, okay? You know exactly what it is that you want. You know the results that you want, and you're willing to put that work in to get it. You're willing to put that up, because look at this. You're looking at your happiness, the Ten of Cups and the Star. Baby. Somebody may be trying, you may feel like somebody trying to block your blessings. That ain't going to happen. You've been being patient long enough. Now is your time. Oh. Now, it looks like, see, in the past, you were even the nine of pentacles. So, some of y'all may have jumped on a single train and you're more focused. Or some of y'all are just really, really zoned in and focused on yourself. Like, if you're giving yourself a lot of self-love, you're very focused. Like, I'm getting very focused, driven, very driven. Now, we got the magician for future energy. The nine of wands want to jump out. You y'all are avoiding drama at all costs because you're on a mission. And for some of you, I'm getting that there could possibly be like a separation. And you're just trying to like you're separating yourself from pettiness. You're separating yourself from people who um are trying to bring you drama or bring you down because you're on a new journey. The fool and the ace of cups. Y'all. <laughs> Y'all ain't playing no games. Y'all got, y'all confidence is on 10, honey. The strength, the king of wands. Y'all taking action. Some of y'all are dealing with the Leo. Wow, y'all are taking control. Y'all are taking control. A lot of y'all are manifesting. Y'all have manifested this new beginning. Y'all have manifested this. Yep, yeah, look at that. The Ten of Swords and the Five of Wands. You don't want to, you don't have to, you don't feel like you got to compete with nobody. You don't got to compete with nobody. Okay. Like y'all are picking up the pieces to something that fell apart. Y'all are picking up the pieces beautifully. Okay. Y'all are prepared for whatever. Six of swords, y'all moving on. Even if y'all got to cut people, slice people, dice people along the way, you will not mess with my money, with my happiness, with my glow up, with my shine. Not going to happen. Because I'm telling you, y'all feel, I feel like a lot of y'all feel tricked or somebody tried to play y'all. Not going to happen. Yeah. Y'all feel like y'all don't have to speak on, sh guess what? <sighs> That's over. Okay. All that is over. Y'all done moved on. <laughs> the world. The cultures. Y'all have moved on. Honey, y'all have moved on. Yeah. Some secrets may have came out. It might have, you might have was mad for a little while. Yeah, see, but see, you're not carrying this energy anymore. And I feel like you are disappointed because you got some type of news. But, baby, you may feel like this person wanted to purposely hurt you. You may feel like there could be a King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Oh, excuse me. A Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn who's watching you or you're watching. Aquarius, um, you could be watching the Aquarius. 
or an Aquarius is watching you. But you don't want to hear no bad news. Look at this, the Hermit. Could be dealing with the Virgo. But you're trying to avoid disappointment, things that are disappointing you. You're blocking this shit because your mind, you're focused on your bag. You're focused on success. You're focused on prosperity. Your focus is on abundance. Okay, you know, you ain't got no time. Like, maybe you guys were worried about your finances previously, like before. Um, But I feel like if you guys have started a business or, like, you just took things up to, a, to the next level, I feel like... I feel like y'all got the vibe, y'all got the energy to make this pop. Like, I feel like you're already doing it. Now, how others are viewing you, we got the Queen of Pentacles. Somebody already views you. Yeah, you're, somebody's fine on you. Queen of Pentacles, Virgo Taurus, Capricorn. Um, they feel like you're speaking your truth, and they feel like you're very abundant. Like, you're living in your in an abundant, um, like, you're abundant. Like, you're very uh confident okay like they see you taking action they may even feel like you have a new boyfriend or a new girlfriend but they see you shining the fool and the sun they see you shining they see how y'all have made a, a situation that may have uh left you feeling out in the cold they see how y'all just like <laughs> i don't know who is playing with the ram but the ram it's going to show you. This could be somebody that you knew from your childhood. The High Priest of Six Cups and the Knight of Pentacles. This could be somebody that you knew um, from when you were, like, young. Like, people from from um, your younger days may be watching you. But I'm getting like you're being watched. Um, and people are just looking at you like, damn, this, they done glowed up, ain't it? <laughs> they done took things to the next level, ain't it? They see you getting all this attention with the six of wands. They just not going to say nothing. Two of swords and the X pentacles, they not going to say nothing to you. Um, because they're not sure what, what your reaction is going to be. And they may be watching you on Facebook, and then they're not even your friend. So if your page is in private, they're watching you, and y'all aren't, aren't even friends. And, oh, they jelly, jelly, jelly. Got a little jelly. Got a little jelly energy. You know, with the five of swords. Maybe a little envy. Uh, be careful because, you know, people like to give you that evil eye. You know, and I think that's going to be my next oil that I'm going to present. And it's, it's funny that it's coming out on this reading. Because let me show y'all what I just got in the mail. And this is going to be my next oil. Like, I ordered a bunch of these because I'm getting ready to make some evil eye oils. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. So, y'all make sure that y'all doing, you know, protection, workings, and things of that nature. Because you just, you know, people see you doing good and they want a piece of that or they just want to kind of like, you know, bring negative energy towards you monster page of swords here the star it could be an aquarius as well somebody they're watching because they're trying to see like are you done or have you threw in the towel uh they're looking at your progress like they're watching your progress wondering if if something is over or waiting for your moment of of where you're reigning and you're doing very well waiting for that to kind of like simmer down why does it start here two of swords yep two of swords and high priestess because they don't want you to they're they're spying but they don't want you to know that they're spying this could be an old boyfriend Oh, girlfriend, because we got the Knight of Wands and the Ace of Wands here. Somebody who wants somebody back. The Judgment card is here. So this is somebody from the past that could that possibly like wants you back. We got the Devil here, and you guys' hopes and fears. King of Swords. Mm. You may have felt like this shit was toxic. Okay, and maybe you feel like things happen too fast. Like, it was like everything was good, and then all of a sudden, 
you know, like, it just, things changed. It was a shift, okay? I feel like your your um, focus on a more loving connection with the King of Cups and the Two of Cups here and the Lovers could be dealing with the Gemini. But I feel like you're a, this could be a fear. Like, somebody here is extremely toxic, especially, like, the way that they communicate. They could be overly sexual. They could be overly indulging, like, overindulging alcohol. Or they're just, like, really uh, cutthroat, like, with their communication and their words. So you possibly have put this situation on hold and you're trying to find some, someone more mature, okay, who's not going to play with your emotions and your feelings, okay, who's not going to juggle as well because I'm getting a lot of juggling energy. Yeah, we got the sun getting picking up Leo's energy, but I feel like you're looking, somebody here was um, very sexual, like I'm getting like overly, overly sexual um, someone could have been married here as well with the four of wands and the five of pentacles. Maybe you started to lose your confidence in this, um, connection while they was gaining theirs. Um, but I feel like right now as the outcome being the queen of swords, I feel like y'all are ice king, ice queen now. It ain't nothing. Yep. Ten of wands. Okay. <laughs> Emperor. Y'all are taking back control. Y'all are taking back control. I feel like some of y'all may have lost, like, some of y'all may, that's the thing, like, uh, Aries is normally really extremely confident. Um, so, it's kind of odd that somebody, like, an Aries, Aries don't normally let people get them down, but y'all are still human, okay? Y'all are still human. Um, but I feel like whoever did, whoever was playing with y'all, they done messed up now because now the glow up, the boss up is real. <laughs> and they got to sit on the sidelines and watch. Mine's the Ten of Wands here. The Death Court. <laughs> mm -hmm. Could be dealing with the Scorpio, but we got the... Y'all going to try new things. Eight of Pentacles and the Ace of Wands. Y'all trying something new. Okay? <laughs> Y'all are going to switch the game. Y'all going to try something new and switch the game up. And whoever uh, doesn't deserve to be there, y'all going to cut them off with no problem. It ain't nothing. Friends or whatever associates today, you cross me, cut off tomorrow. <laughs> cut off the same day. The minute of. <laughs> yeah, see, some of y'all about to get a new. Y'all have, um, I'm getting like a new start. I'm getting there's a new beginning. You're feeling more in control, more dominant um, for the males. For the females, y'all are operating in a very... We know that Aries, y'all dominant. We know that. <laughs> we know that. Y'all are, are being more social. Y'all about to get a lot of attention. Okay? This could be on social media platforms. But you realize, they time gonna come. Judgment. Justice. <laughs> <laughs> they time going to come in the three of wands. Y'all just going to sit back and wait. They going to get what they deserve, okay? Because I feel like you guys were a very good person. We got you guys here as the empress. You are a really good person, the empress or the emperor, okay? And this person may have just, you know, had other options. Other options doesn't necessarily have to be um, other females or other males. They just was occupied doing other things. And, you know... It is what it is. <laughs> so this is the reading that I have for my Aries, okay? Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below, and I'm going to chat with y'all later. All right? Don't forget to check the description box, guys, to support this channel, okay? By um, online shopping on the website, as well as booking a personal reading. Ciao for now.